welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel in this short video lecture i will guide you for cantilever beam steel reinforcement construction that is simply supported beam or floor beam you can see this is also floor beam i will guide you for cantilever beam which length is 5 feet this is cantilever slab on the top of this they will provide steel reinforcement that one is also cantilever beam which length is 5 feet size of this cantilever beam is 18 by 12 inches you can see clearly we have four steel rods at the bottom and three at the top dia is 16 millimeter they did the design of this cantilever beam same like simply supported beam so this is one of the big mistake second guys you can see they didn't provide any development length at the end of this cantilever beam so this is the second mistake you can see guys three steel rods at the bottom three at the top stirrup dia is 8 mm remember guys cantilever beam steel reinforcement design is changed from the simply supported beam but they did the same design that's why because they don't know about the steel structural design therefore in cantilever beam we don't have any support or column at the end of this beam so therefore the design should be changed in upper portion of cantilever beam we should provide maximum numbers of steel reinforcement compared to its bottom because this is the opposite design of simply supported beam that's why because on the top of this we applied the para parapet wall or also we can use the live load on as you can see this is the end of the beam but you can't see any development length from upper portion of this beam or for lo from lower portion of this beam the spacing is about five inches you can see the third mistake is hooks are bent on 90 degree it should be provided on 135 degree and cantilever beam extra steel rod should be provided at the upper portion of this beam but they didn't provide they did a simply design of this cantilever beam next guys the cantilever beam end should be the end thickness should be minimum compared to at starting point guys you can see but here the depth is same which is 18 inches width is 12 inches they used here 60 rods you can see this is simply supported beam they used extra steel rods like this they should provide extra steel rods also in cantilever beam because that is very important to provide because on the top of cantilever beam we are providing the cantilever slab so therefore it's important to do the proper steel structural design you can see the shuttering on the top of this they will provide the steel reinforcement with the spacing of 4 by 4 inches you can see this is floor beam construction they used here 60 grade steel rods This is a short video but very important to know about the technical terms of steel reinforcement practically. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.